France dug themselves a hole and disappeared down it. England and Germany have dug themselves out of holes. They have certainly had their moments on the international stage in days gone by. Forward by Cannavaro, held up by Yakinta. Flags was offside once Di Natale returned the pass. Yeah. He hadn't seen it. He still got a shot away, Yakinta. Wasn't threatening, but the flag had gone up. That's a good ball, isn't it? It was just ping. Dorica on by Vitek, it's come down for Hamzik! Who, had he caught that sweetly, might very well have established a lead. By the way, how poor was that defensively? I mean, the Italians just lost focus on that, and now there's an inquest going on. De Rossi's having a pop at Cannavar. Vitek, Stock has gone ahead of him, Hamzik has gone ahead of him. The fullback Pekarik is getting up alongside him. Kuchka for Vitek. Head in front of Darren Can, the English assistant. Well, Gattuso's baffled by that, and I think Vitek, he's a big lad, but I think he's one of these guys that likes to throw himself a bit. I think to Skirtle. It's in by Stock. More explicable punch from uh, Marchetti, and uh, a drive back over from uh, Zabavnik. Yeah, it's, it's bounced up quite high. He probably needed to get over it that little bit more, Zabavnik, but goalkeeper's probably done the right... Champions are in a deep, deep hole. Robert Vitek for Slovakia. And the world is stood on its head. Well, De Rossi's making his presence felt in every game, isn't he? Been involved in the goals they've scored so far. That was a dreadful, dreadful pass on his part. You could see his reaction. As soon as he tried to chase back, it's an easy little slip in. Really well taken by Vitek. I think he does brilliantly to keep it away from Marchetti's right hand. It might have been the barest touch from the goalkeeper. But, oh, Daniele De Rossi will hang his head in shame with that one. He's just handed Slovakia a lead. Italy behind yet again. Italy just... They just don't look together. They don't look cohesive. Vitek. Jendrasek. Hamsik. Oh, Cannavaro could be in trouble here because... He's gone in hard on Hamsik and the Italian captain's already seen a yellow card. I wonder whether the assistant might have seen it. Stock. Stop! Ah! It's a good save from Marchetti. Well, you just wonder whether the ball did a little bit in the air as well because he seemed to really scramble at the last moment, Marchetti. But look how much Italy sat off and allowed Sturber to get the shot away. Might have been just creeping in too. It's a fine, fine. Giving it away to Cannavaro. Down by Pepe, hit by Montalivo, not a problem. Yeah, he knew he was getting closed down from behind at the, the last moment. By Kuchka. Uh, he just rushed it a little. And get About 500 miles north of Rome, Bratislava. They're not so very far away from each other. Quite call it a derby, there's a bit of uh, landmass between them. And Vitek, I think, has just caught Fabio Cannavaro on that one. Seems to have just gone over the ball, maybe, yeah, he did, he caught him on the foot. The so Over his own crossbar by a hair's breadth from Martin Skirtle. You lucky, lucky boy, I don't think he meant that. I think he got himself in a muddle when it came in, he was unsure what he was doing. That could easily have gone in. He's just got himself in a bad position, Martin Skirtle. That's towards the end of set. Going for Vitek. A little push. And the Slovakia, if they take time to set this free kick, can ensure that... Vitek made it hard for Chiellini and thumped with a great verve by uh, Juraj Kuchka. Not very far wide. That is a fantastic hit. Great strength as well by Vitek just to hold his man off. And he just set it up. Go, go on then. Let's try and hit that on the volley. And yeah, flip Peter just at the vital moment. Only three times in World Cup history have the champions of the world gone out in the group stage of the following tournament. In place of Gennaro Gattuso, that is offence for you. And he has also made alterations to his back four 
involving the withdrawal of the young fullback Crescito and his replacement by an and would if it stayed this way certainly be their most impressive international win ever that's uh, a foul on Pagliarella by uh, Pekarik I think the card is right too Peter He's, it's mistimed Pagliarella has been given in 35 here's Maggio Oh, and that was a real chance for uh, Di Natale. Well, what a mess he made of that. I mean, he's got to swivel on it, he's got to try and turn on it, and then hit it with that right foot. It's a lovely little run, a good ball, he's onside, Yakinta might have been off, not interfering. You know, maybe the keeper would have smothered it because he's come out very, very... Di Natale. Pagliarella. Di Natale. Goalkeeper's lost it, but... Uh... He's able to gather second time. Nice height, that's all I'd say. I and mean, you know, it wasn't it wasn't hit with great pace. He's looked for the placement, Di Natale, and it's a decent try. Um, and the keeper had time to actually let it slip. To be honest, he should have held. I've stopped now for Slovakia as Italy necessarily open up. Vitek waiting. Stop may go himself. Miroslav Stock has lashed it wide. Well, he had the room. He had the room and he had the time to make sure it was on target. And at least work Marchetti. Cannavaro has gotten across the back here's corner again. Hamzik with it. Away by Pepe. Back in by Hamzik. Vitek! <laughs> Fallen champions! Robert Vitek, the heavyweight striker of Slovakia, has Italy on the canvas. Lippi is staring out. Well, the thing is now, Marcello Lippi has played all his cards. He can't make any more changes. And once it just comes back out to Hamsik, it's just beaten away near post. He just goes first time, and it seems to just catch Chiellini on the back foot. Vitek reads it a little bit quicker. And he's just gotten there. It's an opportunist goal, and he's tucked it away beautifully past Marchetti near post, Vitek. Pepe, Qualiarella's come over to the right-hand side. He's got away from Zabavnik, he's fed it in for Yakinta. Qualiarella, Di Natale, 2-1, game on! Champions not yet ready to bow out! Well, it's trouble in the goal mouth now because and all the shenanigans have kicked off. Italy trying to get the ball back quickly. Mucha wouldn't let it, and now Qualiarella, has he been touched or has he just gone down? Trying to get the goalkeeper in trouble. Trauma, trauma. Lost tempers. Pepe and Skirtle are at. Di Natale. Oh, 2-2! Two, two. He's offside. Oh, the flag is up! The flag's up against Qualiarella. Aimed in for the substitute. Kopunek! He's done it! Champions have gone now, eliminated by the first touch of a World Cup debutant. Italy out. Farewell, Lippi. Farewell, Cannavaro. You're great. He got them passing. De Rossi, he might as well. Too late. Kopinek closed him down, that's what he was there for. Pagliarella, beautiful goal, beautiful goal. And there are three minutes left of stoppage time. That is a fabulous strike. One more, and they save themselves. This is stunning. Once it comes to, to have the composure and the presence to just... Italy dethroned, the champions have fallen at the end of the most thrilling World Cup match. Lippi disappears, Cannavaro disappears, possibly forever. Italy crash at the first turn for the first time in 36 years and the World Cup debutant Slovakia march on.